Welcome to Ask Miss Me Years, where we answer your most burning questions and solve your most nagging problems. I may not know all the answers, but I'll know someone who will. What kind of impression are you making in online meetings? Is it great, good, okay, negligible, sad, or disastrous? Whether we are working from home, looking for work, or connecting with friends, video chats are now an inescapable way of life. The screen is now our stage, and we only have that little thumbnail square in which to shine. Today, the Stop Live and Virtual Events MC, hosting mentor, actress, and director will coach us on our online presence. Please welcome Issa Litton. Ooh, wow, what an intro. Hi. Thank you very much. <laughs> that was quite an intro. Thank you. <laughs> so nice to see you. Lovely How to are you see today? You it's a good day. It's a very, very good day. Uh, I had a taping earlier for makeup, how to do your makeup for Zoom meetings. And I'm also uh, finishing up my list for the attendees for this Saturday's webinar, online right. impact webinar. Right. I took the second webinar that you, yes, you did. gave and I learned so much and I'm <laughs> applying so many pointers and I was kind of nervous today because I have to <laughs> have you in the show and you're maybe you're watching my every move, but never mind. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> Remember my tip, which we'll get to later. I'm actually doing that right now, right? So actually, I've been noticing you have been applying and I'm so, so proud. Oh, so I hope my your viewers gosh. have also noticed uh, these little changes that make you more impactful online. Wow. As, uh, as one of the early adopters of virtual events hosting, you've been so very busy. What are some of the, I mean, it's it's been uh, over a hundred days and I think you have hosted already countless virtual events. Uh, it started the day after Easter Sunday. So Easter Sunday was what, April 12? So around April 13 or 14, I was already asked to do something on Lazada. And even I reacted like you, I'm sure, na, ha? Magbibenta na? Di ba? Parang, yun yung ganun ba? Parang, ha? Online na tayo? I mean, I mean di ba? May, may ganun na factor na, guys, pandemic. I mean, there is that. Right, but then, right. they said also, Miss Isa, because we trust you'll know what to say. Wow. 
So parang kahit ako uwi na pressure ako nun. <laughs> diba? Pero you know what? Yes, there is a way. There is a way to be sensitive. There is a way to broadcast. There is a way to sell. Because don't forget, we're thinking of the Philippine economy. Yes, that's a big part of us keeping life going. Diba? We have to work. Everyone right. wants to go back to work. So of course, I'm grateful to have that blessing that I have an avenue to work. When my real arena of work has been shut down. There right, will be, right. until, until now, there's none. And you cannot see it being approved or open for months to come. So again, with live events and mass gatherings, that arena is still bawal until now. That's why I'm, I'm fighting for live events or I'm keeping uh, my ears out for whatever's happening. And we're trying to talk about how the live events industry is, a, is such a crucial part of the Philippine economy. I'm doing my part with that. We call it NLEC right. Anyway, uh, so here back online, then there was like the Go Negosho, Mentor Me Online programs. I, I did a number of that. And a lot of uh, my co-hosts as well did, like RJ Ledesma, uh, Chal Lontok, uh, Gretchen Ho. We all hopped on board uh, when it came to the Go Negosho ones. And that was great practice. Uh, then corporate accounts started. Some really wanted to jumpstart. And these are the active corporations, like pharmaceutical corporations, a lot of real estate definitely want to be significant to the to their consumers online diba? but yes even uh, lifestyle also started uh, saying we want to connect with their consumers online right and last but not least rappler because rappler yes. has their round table discussions as I've well so i was really like so it's like hey there there's there's hope and, this and is, when... go ahead yeah so there's hope and this is the new medium this is the new way for anyone, uh, not just hosting, but for anyone to communicate. Right. Everyone says, I want to commu- I want to keep in touch with our consumers. This is the only way we can reach them. I want to keep in touch with my clients, with my employees. Diba? Life is now online because everyone's still confined to their homes. It's great. And you have a special uh, like, uh, soft spot in your heart for the teachers whom you've yes, been helping do. along, right? Would you like to talk about... Uh, what you've been doing to help our teachers? Actually, I was invited because I posted the, my poster for this coming Saturday's webinar on online impact, which is online delivery and presence, how you can upgrade yourselves. Uh, my The head teacher of my daughter saw it and she's like, Uy, tulungan mo naman yung junior high school faculty. And that's where I came from. That's uh, my... That's where I graduated in San Agustin in high, high school, San Agustin Makati. So I'm like, yes, sure, of course, why not? Dahil nga nahihirapan sila. And for me, the future of my children, the education of my children, any parent out there can relate. The teachers are having a hard time. They're not right. adept to this. They have to break classroom habits. Everyone has to adapt. And guess what? I seem to have done very well at it. Why not share? my tips with them especially because they have to translate this with how many classes the of, of students in a classroom they usually have what 40 and they yeah. usually handle five sections at least each i think our teachers need all the help they can get so i even actually reached out to friends uh from other universities like hey do you have programs because most of them already did it like a month right. ago like how you can translate online but that's just fixing your curriculum to making sure your class uh, schedules and class assignments fit an online medium. But you forget right. you need to speak and you need to be present and deliver your classes now in this medium. And that's an entirely different skill set. So and especially why. if you're talking to children who have like a very short attention span, right? Oh, you yeah. have to capture their attention. Definitely. I, I spoke, though, to junior high school. So these are the grade 8, 9, and okay. above. So my warnings were like, ma'am, sir, this is the batch, and this is the generation who was born in this time. Yes. Yeah, so <laughs> sila kaysa sa inyo. Uh-oh. So mga tips Uh-oh. ko, disable nyo yung mga chat. Baka mamaya nag-lecture kayo, naglalandian lang yung mga. They're teenagers! <laughs> They're teenagers! <laughs> <laughs> How are you right. a teenager? We used to doodle and pass notes. The yeah, yeah, yeah. We're and we're so used to multitasking, right? Exactly. We don't know what. So what <laughs> are these kids who really know what they're doing? And especially the teacher when they're probably lecturing, hindi kita lahat ng squares. So baka two, three, nag, diba? they might be naughty. I mean, kids are kids. Kids are right. kids. 
<laughs> so let's <laughs> talk about uh, what you call upgrading your online impact. Why is it essential? What if you're uh, technophobic or shy or you'd rather chat or you'd rather, you know, not really be on screen, but I guess it's inescapable these days, right? Definitely. That is the word, inescapable. How else will you communicate? I mean, sure, you can have a phone call, send an email, but there's still this factor of wanting to connect with people. And this is the medium. Online is the medium, be, be it Zoom, be it uh, MS Teams. There are so many platforms. But either way, you are now broadcasting or communicating via a, a screen. So you are seen and you are heard. If you, if you don't upgrade, it's so easy for anyone to tune you out. They're like, mm. especially because you're so used to when you're watching a screen, you know you can change the channel. You know you can swipe left or right if you don't like what you see, right? So, you, sayang yung opportunity. Sayang naman yung point ng bakit tayo nag-meeting, bakit tayo nagpe-present, kung hindi kayo mag-upgrade. And for me, what I do teach is this is skills. It's really a skill set that I manage to share with you. Uh, there are motivational speakers. Let me put it this way. In fact, you're one, right? When you give them the drive, when you give ideas and thoughts. And I love that. But I'm not just ideas and thoughts. I'm actually giving you a practical sit, sk skill set list right. of what to do that you can apply and control. Right. And honestly, once you start doing it, which you saw on the spot during my webinar, there yes. was an instant, aha, eureka <laughs> moment. You're like, you're right. You're right. I sound better. And you're right. I, I'm more conscious now. I'm yeah. aware. So, there are things you can learn really to improve. Um, exactly. There are things you can do. It's, it, it's beyond learning. It's things you can apply and do. So if you're a technophobe, okay, you're saying, ayoko talaga, then how can you adapt? Right. I, I personally like to advocate, let's have a growth mindset. Yes. We cannot control things around yes. us. So I learned this the hard way, diba? We, You can't control even your partner. You can't control your kids. <laughs> you can't control your parents, diba? There are all these things beyond your control, but you can learn from right. it. You can adapt. Yes. You can control yourself. What, so stick to the growth mindset of what can you control then? What can you improve on? Guess what? It's yourself. <laughs> and so, we can learn to control the Zoom. Just learn. Yeah, that's part of the tool. That's part of the webinar. Learning the tools. Stop that saying, I don't want to learn that because I don't want to learn that. Or, Mirta, I'm like that. Yes, I'm like that. I'm like that. I'm like that. And I think these days, now that people are so attuned to video, right, as a way of receiving their information, I mean, they would rather watch a video than read an article. Or read a book. Right? Or read a book. So whether yeah. you are a doctor or a nutritionist or a teacher or a fitness professional, Anyone. communication skills are such a big must. Yes. Even if you're a secretary, an assistant, someone applying for a job. Uh, remember now, one of the webinar attendees was a college, uh, a high school student graduate who wanted to make sure the interview to his college, to the yes. university he was applying so to, vital, that, he, yeah. that he would be good, you know, he would be prepared for it. And I was like, wow, I didn't think of that. So right. everyone is communicating, everyone. Right. It's not enough not to write well, right? You yeah. need to speak well and come across. Deliver well and, and come and across. You. That's true. Right. That's why you and are seen and you are heard. What really helps is that you are also an actress and a director. Can you talk about how that has helped you? Isa is an Alio awardee for... Uh, female MC. <laughs> best female MC. Not to mention an actress. I watched one of your plays and it was a comedy. I think I was dying of laughter. <laughs> comedy of Center on the Repertory Philippines. Yes. yes, yes. Watching Please that tell movie. us how your experience in directing and acting Helps, helps you train people. Actually, yes. This was pointed out to me by Direct Elmer La Pena from Saga event. Yes. Uh, it was part of actually my first group of webinar. Where Tim Yap also attended. I really thank Tim for his support because, like you, heard about it from Tim. 
right? And it really right. set an example for the rest of the professionals out there that you still learn, you keep each other sharp. Thank you, Tim, for that message. So, okay, Derek Elmer said, you know, Isa, why you're so good at this? I always want, I keep saying, I always wanted to be a teacher. He's like, no, it's because you're a director and because also of your acting background. Why is that relevant? Like, okay, she's supposed to be teaching online presence and delivery, the back. First, as an actor, and because you also had Cherry Hill in TikTok, she made me realize it. I was watching that interview you had with her. Look at her. She's a, one of the best actors out there, especially film actors. They know how to work with the camera. Okay. They know how to work with the camera. They know where to look. They know their angles. So that's the actor part. It's not even the theater part of me. It's the TV and film acting that was relevant in teaching this particular medium. Because in film language, ladies and gentlemen, this is a close-up. Anything shoulders above, and yes, your face is seen, this is a close-up. This is extreme close-up. Pero close-up, okay, this is close-up. So that's the actor part. And it helped also that I was a commercial model. So again, you work the camera. Now, I'm actually an assistant director. I have yet to direct something to be to to i have yet to earn the title director but i am an assistant director and what does that mean i'm the one who takes charge of directing actors models clients even so i'm used to telling people what to do suggesting to them can you face here can you look there can you make your expression like this can you make your voice like this can you say this line this way i think that's me being an AD especially uh, prepared me for this role right now, for this role as mentor and online teacher, because it's what I used to do on sets. And now it's just translating it here. Because yeah, you can be an actor, but it doesn't mean you can tell other people what to do. Na hindi ka claro. Right, right. But, that, as AD, but as an AD, I already mastered that over, what, 15, 20 years ago when I used to do music videos for Marie Hamora. I did some commercials as well under Bossing Abaya, uh, which is, again, who I met because of my mentor, Direk Marilu Diaz Abaya. Wow. I was, I was her PA with my Barcadas on in Noon at Ngayon, uh, her movie there with sila, Dina Bonavi. I learned everything about the set from Direk Marilu, and then I became the AD of some of the other commercial directors, then my friend, Marie Hamora, who is now part of uh, Universal Studios, ba? She's now in LA. I'm so yes. proud of her. So <laughs> over 35 music videos come together, some commercials, some films, and I'm translating it now. So that's why me, when I look at you, okay, tilt up, chin up, no, 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 down. <laughs> I'm following and your instructions. That, that details, exactly, because <laughs> educated na yung mata ko. I know what you need to see. And I can help translate things for you. Now you think you're doing, but you're actually not. Right. It takes a director's eyes to be able to bring that out of you. So that's the background of how being an actor and an assistant director really helps in this medium. And of course, being host, well, you practice it eh? <laughs> for the past 20 years. <laughs> and what's it like to direct non-actors or non-models? Like now you're dealing with teachers and very regular right. people, right? Clients, oh, yes. Clients. Yes. executives, CEOs, yes. oh, what's that yes. like? Industry owners, leaders, right. the Bambiers. Because I am most and for uh, first and foremost a corporate and lifestyle host, right? So yes. that's my client. And you have set. to give them directions like, could you please mute your mic? <laughs> I actually what is that train, like? Because they, there's the tech team. And syempre, ganun, ganun. And parang sometimes there's something, kasi nga, baka ayaw pakinggan, and ako na yung nandun. Actually, because ako na yung nandun, diba? So my screen, like, and then your screen. Eh sila, they patch in via either chat or bosses lang. So since I'm there na, sir, uh, you're, could you turn on a light? Do you have a light source, sir? Yeah, it's here. Yeah, I see it on your chin, sir. Sir, could you elevate it? Like maybe put a book under it. Then, ayan, there, sir, I see your eyes already. I mean, I'm always respectful. Because, again, we are dealing with CEOs, owners, industry leaders. You have, you have to give them the respect. And they are bosses. They are the ones in command. They are the ones, right? So right. how can you tell them what to do? So, right. But they appreciate it. Like, even in international talks, 
when I come across international speakers. Because again, my job as the host is to introduce them. And you want them to look good, diba? And they're so set now, usually on stage, they have these clickers and I know. But here, uh, they, again, you'll get the tips later between Mirza and me. I'm like, sir, could you elevate this one? <laughs> Like, sir, can you take a look, you know, parang, even down to the, do you have tissue next to you, sir, or ma'am? Yeah. Ooh. Could you just wipe this one? Just take out a little <laughs> oil because you're a bit oily. Even that way. Yeah. Because I'm like, sir, I just want you to look good, sir. It's like, ah, thank you, Isa. Thank you. Yeah. We appreciate it because I and want we, them to look their best. And yeah. then it's now when I say, sir, I teach it po kasi. Then they right. got interested. And then I got my corporate bookings. At the back. Yeah. And rightly so. so. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. So now let's go right into our tips and pointers. Now, a lot I'm of us, whether, whether we're CEOs or teachers or even uh, people used to hosting live but not online, make mistakes. And there are some very common mistakes that we may not be aware that we're making. Let's yeah. go to the very first most common mistake. And oh, yes. Is. Here we go. Here we go. Let's take number one. Not looking at the camera. Okay. When you do Skype or when you do FaceTime, using a cell phone, right? Where you look is you see, again, the face of the person. So you look right. like you're talking to each other. But Mirsa, here in this medium, I'm looking at you now. Hi, Mirsa. Right. How are you? Right. Oh, really? Oh, so. <laughs> I'm not looking at the camera. Look at me. Do I look like I'm connecting with you? For me, I'm connecting with you that I can see your facial expression. But someone watching, it's like, ay, hindi niya pinakikinggan. You look disinterested, di ba? Right, right. Versus, look now. Hi, Mirza. How are you? Yeah. I'm so happy to be here. Look at so the that, connection now. Yeah. I'm That's why I'm looking at the light and I can't really see your face because I'm looking at yes. the light while I'm talking to you. Glance <laughs> once in a while, di ba? That's the thing. Glance yeah. once in a while. If I'm talking, you can afford to glance. Right. Because it, it's nice also to sh keep looking at the camera because the image that you are projecting now is that you are enraptured, that you're so attentive to your speaker. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> the and from especially in a Zoom setup, if there are four or five screens, it's so obvious when you're like... Right. Look, and you can see, so like, some people... And you're like, yeah, the ba? Yeah. Yeah, Some oh people my. are ano pa, eating, texting. Diba? Oh, yeah. And the thing is, you look like you're texting, but you're actually looking at the screen. But I'm talking to you. No, it doesn't look like it. So please look at the camera. And how you'll project later, because you'll see, like right after this episode, it's going to be posted in your page forever. Right. So when you replay it, you're like, hey, you're right. I look attentive. So look right. at the camera if you want to establish a connection, not just with your viewers or whoever you're talking to, with your boss, with your client, with your employees, but look at the camera to establish a connection and for you to look like you are attentive, that you're giving them their due importance. Right. That's tip number okay. one. <laughs> Mistake number two. Oh, boy. <laughs> Can you I hear me? Can yeah, you hear me? Me? I'm here. I'm here. Hello? My mic is on. My mic on. is. Can you hear me? Yeah. Hello, I'm like, I can't. I can't. Right. But that's true. Um, volume. Of course. Wait. The root of this problem is internet connection. If you don't right. have good internet connection, I'm sorry. There's no going around it, right? You you'll be choppy at best if you're you're fighting. You're trying to stay in the stream, but. Volume matters. You know why? Nakakapagod pakinggan. You're not like a radio that you just blast in the background. And admit it, even with the radio, you only tune in once in a while. But here, you're seen, and syempre, you want naman to be in sync with what you're seeing and what you're hearing. So some people have habits they have to break. Na feeling mo, because I'm in front of something, I'm ready to declare now everything. Yes, ma'am. Yes, sir. <laughs> This is my report for you today, right? Yes, the sales are in, ma'am. Would you like the bad feeling nila? Ano to walkie-talkie? <laughs> <laughs> or, or like how you would the phone, diba? Yes, ma'am. Opa, ma'am. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Yes, yes, sir. Diba? <laughs> you see that? And you know what? This is technology. Trust, there's a mic in this device, especially if you're using your laptop. Look for where the mic is. 
and just project your voice there. In fact, here's another tip. Just buy one yeah. of these comes with your cell phone. No need for fancy, expen expensive earphones or even the, those mics. Unless it's your career, go ahead. And if you have the means to buy it. But this alone, you plug in, you already reduce ambient noise, like the hum of the aircon or the electric fan. Or guess what? Tumatahol na aso. <laughs> Na tricycle, diba? Or may tumitilaok na manok. Right. Diba? Or a crying baby. A cry of course, your kids. What if you have kids, right? Someone's cooking, someone's TV is on. I mean, all these, you're at home. So you simply plugging in will help take out the ambient noises. And because it the mics nowadays are built in the way they are, that it's near your mouth. Yes. Trust that it's picking it up. It's picking it up naturally. There. Actually, if you hold it pa like that, narinig ko yun, Mirs. Narinig mo yun, Hello. <laughs> diba? Don't do this na, hi, ma'am. Hi, hello. <laughs> uh, unless you want to sound like you you are doing something, you know, <laughs> between you and your, hi, love, how are you tonight? I miss you. Diba? Oh. No, 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 no. Again, trust that this is doing its job. That's why it's right. there. It's ergonomic. It was planned and you know executed the way it is to help you, the end user. So a at least again. Mine, sorry, anecdote long. A friend of mine was in a very important meeting, and her mm -hmm. husband was nearby washing the dishes, mm -hmm. and he dropped a plate, and then he cursed like a very malotong, super super vulgar curse word. Heard by the entire meeting. Oh no! The first word starts with a letter. No. no. See again, you no. cannot control no. what's happening no. around you. Control what you can, and right. that's we're going to a third tip. I'll get to that third tip because of this tip of what you just said. I'll get to that tip when we get to it. But oh wait, speaking of volume, also uh, again, just practice. All you have to do is record yourself, guys. Because so you can say, Mirs, do I sound pleasant? Do I sound nice? Diba? Yeah. Can you hear me? Especially some are really soft spoken. Let's not just talk about the loud ones. You might yeah. feeling automatic nice. Sir, yes, ma'am. Yes. No shouting. Please don't shout at it. It's being picked up. But then there are others who are like, Yes, I like it. I like what you're presenting now. Can you <laughs> email that to me? Diba? Oh, what if a client's like that? Yeah. You're like, a man, could you kindly speak up a bit louder? The bad. So again, right. don't don't be scared or don't be shy because the point is you're communicating, and and you want to make sure you deliver what they need, especially if you're talking to a client. So just say, ma'am, if if you don't mind, could you kindly speak up a little louder? The bad. At least like that. Be being respectful will get you places. Right. But not saying what you need to say. Talo ka. Right. And and if you have bad audio consistently, what does it say about you? And how does it damage your professional impression? Hindi na ikaw yung kakausapin. Diba? Parang, eh, malabo yan. Ma maano yan. Punta na tayo sa iba. Asay mo na lang sa iba yan. Diba? Mm -hmm. Yung ganun. And wait, here's a tip. In Zoom, if you have a meeting and you have bad audio, turn off the video. Right. You can turn it off. But when the right. video's off, hindi na raw nahihirapan yung upload. Tama ba right. yung explanation ko? Right. Because ang importante naman is they can listen to you eh. Yes. So make sure na lang your volume is better. And syempre, right. in my webinar, you know this, I'm not gonna say it here. We, I also give you other tips to sound more interesting. Right. But I think here, volume matters. So make sure you're yes. projecting to the microphone of your device, whether it's a cell phone or a laptop or even a, a desktop computer, make sure you're projecting to the microphone properly. Don't shout and not too, not too little also. You can record yourself and find out how you sound. The right. Just play it back, just play it back. And I guess mm -hmm. mute your audio unless you're speaking because I, yes. was in a, I was in a class the other day and then one of the students in the class was talking to her yaya. In the middle of the class, so she's like, in day. Pag dating sa palengke, we're like, ano yun? Ano yun? Right? It's very distracting. Exactly, exactly. So we'll we'll get to that. That's actually what our no our fourth tip. This this mute thing and video. We'll get oh, to that. Oh, okay. Sorry. Okay. Yeah, we'll tip get to that one. Three. 
Mistake number three, a very oh, unflattering okay. angle. Again, devices are now cameras, ladies and right. gentlemen, to everyone watching. This like is not no our laptop anymore. Like not, this. Let me, yeah, here, let me put it. This, <laughs> there, this is laptop. See, look, it's my Harry Potter book set, which is where I, I know. This is laptop. I can tell. You know why? Look, the background is tilted. Diba? And look, forehead nyo, itong laptop view, it's so not flattering. In fact, kung ganyan lang kung laptop. Yeah, yeah. oh, oh yeah. Yes, I like that. Uh, what do you see, nostril? <laughs> Isn't it so unflattering? Right. Um, you wanna when I'm un- talking to my mom, it's always like this. Ma! <laughs> Ma, we can only see your bangs. <laughs> That's so funny. Oh my gosh. Oh, wait. It's true. Every so Sunday. Please. Exactly. Ma, so hope you're watching, Ma. <laughs> Learn, Tita. Learn. <laughs> so elevate your laptop. And again, it's face. Again, think face level or camera is eye level. And you will thank me dahil hindi sasakit ang batok or leeg ninyo. Right. Diba? Because as a laptop, you're always like this. So elevate it, please. In fact, now there are laptop tables. Yes, diba? which are like automatic. Space. Yeah, you can bring it up or down. Again, don't you just love how people are innovating? They're coming up with new products to help right. us consumers. So if you have the means and the money, why don't you buy one of those, right? So please. Oh, can I a TV tray? Yeah, TV like tray. breakfast in bed tray. Will that work? Depends how tall you are. Oh. Ah, I, I want to, uh, here's another thing. It was from Carl, Carl Kunanan. Also, he, he attended, I think, the first batch. So you say, he was like this, man. Like, is I elevated it na. It's not. It's the wrong height. Look, de ba parang pugut. It's like a floating head. It's like, oh, but my chair is slow. I'm like, put a pillow. <laughs> I'm like, see again. Me, that's me as an AD. I think that's me as an assistant director thinking. You look for ways to make yourself fit in the frame, de ba? So it's very film talk. It's very film language when it comes to maneuvering the camera. But just trust, right. guys. This is the last thing you want. Yeah. Double, double chin. chin. Sometimes I'm talking to uh-huh. a double chin. Diba? <laughs> exactly. Or this, Mirza. Yeah. Oh, yes. The forehead, diba? Guys, don't. Save yourself. Look presentable and look like someone I want to see and watch. And this and is also, it. also, what does it say about you that you don't pay attention to details, right? Or you're not, you don't care about I mean, they might seem like superficial things, but they actually oh, are very distracting. You. Yes, because sometimes I say na lang ng, ng kausap mo, whoever's on the other side of that screen, ka meeting mo, may pimple ka. <laughs> Naka, or, nakatulog ka ba? <laughs> Uy, singa ka naman, blow your nose. Oh my God! <laughs> Di ba? It shows, guys! I'm helping you out. Please, I hope this is a wake-up call for all of you. <laughs> Are there you some like ane- funny anecdotes that you want to share, or at the ex- not naman that you're tattling, but maybe they can help our viewers? Yeah, well, we basically have been demonstrating actually because I'm sure now that we've been, I've been maneuvering my laptop, the ganyan. You can tell probably in your in your next meeting, the next time you zoom, especially if it's a work call, you'll be like, "Ayun, yan yung sinasabi ni Isa, yan yung sinasabi ni Isa at Mirza, <laughs> diba? Because yeah, I think after we get to the tips, mas maganda na yung kwentuhan. Parang I'm getting ahead of myself if I make kwento now, because it's also all the tips are are intertwined. Eh. You apply right. it all together. Hindi lang right. one is one. So later, right. after the tips, we'll make cuento. Sige. Okay, number four, fumbling with controls. Oh, yes. Again, to na lang. Master these two. Whatever app you're using, whatever broadcast uh, platform you're using, master these two buttons. Where is the mic button on off? And where's the video button? Video on, video off. If not, you look like this. Send ba dito? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Ito, can, can, hey, hear me. Hello. I'm here. Can you hear me now? Yeah, but my mic's on. My mic's on. <laughs> 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 so you're like, 
and the thing is, there's also a corresponding toggle, something supposed to appear in your screen. So you should know that when you press this button, something comes out, like that red mic with a slash, you know you're on mute. Right. So when, also, when, don't fumble with the controls beyond looking like you don't know what you're doing. Like your friend, now, now I want to make cuento. If your friend that happened already, the basag, poo, gun po lang, yes. I know how to mute it now. Poo. <laughs> I muted it now. I can make salo. I can do something about it. Right? So right. You, the rest didn't have to hear the rest of that. Right. If you already knew na, boom. Because I know exactly where it is. Not. <laughs> also, be, like be careful of the share screen because. Yes. Oh, boy. Because I can tell what you've been watching. I, I can tell who you've been, you know, Facebooking. Are you stalking someone? Diba? And a sensitive document. What if it's a financial report? Right. What if it's a financial <laughs> report? So, yung mga share screen na yan. Again, more tips. More tips in the webinar. But fumbling with controls is beyond you not looking like you don't know what you're doing. Right. But it's that if you need it. If right. something happens. Like, something crashes behind me, I already know to do this. See, oh, stop, automatic, it's automatic. And when I come back, I still look like I'm in control, right? <laughs> exactly. Voice put it in. Exactly, because now it is in your control. So those two, at least master those two, mic on and off, right. video on and off. <laughs> okay, here's the next. Ah, okay, to na yung mga kwento. I yeah. was waiting for this last step. The yes. juicy part. Yes, uh, and we, this is the reality. We are all working from home, but you do not have to look or sound like you are at home. Sure, it's forgiving. But that's why we're calling it an upgrade. Upgrade yourself, upgrade your online presence and delivery. So first, look the part. Again, please be dressed. I mean, don't look like you're in the shirt that you slept in. In fact, I always say, Something with a collar, you look professional already. If Even if you don't have a setup like this for your background, think of your background, a plain wall, exactly like what Mirza's background is. A plain, clean wall will do. Hi, Zoom police na po ako, Lala Rimando. Thank you. So a plain wall will do. Third, people walking in. Okay, ito na yung kwento ko. Sige, anecdote. Mirza, Mirza, a very cute anecdote. And we all know this na. Remember Senator Meigs Subiri when he was in what was that? The, the Senate something. His son came in, di ba yung parang nandito yung anak niya, and he was like, it was cute because I thought it worked for him because we not just saw him as a senator but we saw him as a father. That was endearing. In fact, another thing is what was a uh, Brian Ku for one of our go negotiations, the the CEO of Grab Philippines. He already warned us, bakapumasok yung anak ko because the time slot of uh, that mentor me online was 6 to 7.30. Matawagin ako for dinner. Diba? So those again, he came up, Papa, dinner na. But again, what if it was a work meeting? That at least was more casual. And we we were warning everyone, uh, I said it during the broadcast, na, don't worry, that can happen, that can happen, it's okay. But what if it's really an office meeting? What if it's a presentation day? Those are things you cannot afford naman to happen. Like if a baby is crying in the background, diba? Uh, assign these things. Uh, again, someone walking in. Oh, let's not talk about that, that scandal. Remember that? I brought oh, this yeah. You may lumabas. <laughs> you may lumabas sa banyo. Yeah, na hindi, you know, hindi niya why. Huwag natin sabihin. Exactly. <laughs> That's right. See, see what happens if you don't prepare your background. So even if you are working from home, give yourself an upgrade especially for talking about work please be professional look the part prepare your space even if it's just a corner in your home there's nothing you can do again again about tricycles dogs i can hear my dog barking can you sorry nope. see <laughs> so again see it's doing its job your earphones work the work the earphones work but my, my dog's actually barking so these things again i like na be aware and these things, again, you can control. Working at home doesn't have to look like you are at home. So, wow, right. five tips. 
your audio, how you look, your camera as a device, uh, familiarity with the tools you need, mic, video, and yes, professionalize yourself. Don't, it's never an excuse that you say, ito lang meron ko, ito lang kami, right. Find the Lady, way. Find the way, because that speaks of you, right. that you are someone who wants to go beyond what you have to offer something better. And right. trust me, everyone else will follow suit because they're inspired by you. Right. Everyone else will follow suit. How dressed up do you have to get? I mean, you don't have to wear pants, but there have been examples of people who stood up and they weren't wearing pants. Oh boy, <laughs> come on. <laughs> It's a mentality mindset for me as the professional. Actually, I'm wearing a. If you don't, this is not supposed to happen. You're not supposed to do this, but I'm wearing a dress. Yeah, I really don't mind dressing up because it does something to your mindset, especially if I know I'm going to work. Others can be like, "Sige, chill, chill." Naman yung company culture naman, de ba? Hindi naman nila alam, but right. you know, and if you know, it does something to your mind, to your psyche. A part of you is lax. Diba? So do you really want that? I want to be on. I want to be ready. And these right. are habits I've, I've started for myself 20 years ago, and I am still applying it till this day. I, I so want to be consistent. Your energy is not pang pajamas. No. Pang yeah. Boxer short. Boxer short. <laughs> or, or kahit yung mga mga na shredded. Yes, it shows. It does right. something to you. That's why others pang like the best spritz perfume. For me, my go-to is I still this like even with you, I still do my mouth spray. Me I, too. Even <laughs> but it does something to me. I program right. myself that way. Right. Diba? For events. Because I share in live events. You so were saying you, you did a demo where you uh, were doing makeup for online yes. meetings. I heard a teacher yeah. say that she never wore makeup. Uh, to teach children, but now she said the children have to see her lips and her yes. eyes. And so, yes. any tips on how to do makeup for virtual meetings? You want to look as uh, natural as possible. You don't want to look like you're going to a ball, right? Or you're going to uh, an, an event. But you want to look friendly because with lights, you, of course, you need lights to showcase in this medium. It'll wash you out. So, a little color, definitely please fill in your key light. Please fill in your kilay. And you also have to put a little color in your cheeks. In fact, my friend Yuki Higson just said lipstick lang. She puts it on her lips and then she'll rub some on her cheeks. You don't even have to make uh, gasto so much with that. Right. So a little color, definitely kilay to frame your face and cheeks and lips. Oh, and teachers or to anyone, powder is your best friend. <laughs> I, have it. I always have it next to me. Even my loose powder, because who said that oiliness is next to <laughs> what <laughs> poverty ba? or the bad distraction? Ayan pa naman kami mula yeah, si it's right it's next. It's right yon. Yeah. Oh, that's another thing for the work from home. Thank you, Mirza, for bringing that up. I can tell you're working from home or parang ano? Dahil aminin na natin. Dati na papa blow dry tayo. Right, so, and you, di ba? Yung mga tuchang tuchang. So even for you, exactly <laughs> here. The gel nyo man lang yan para polished. Ayan di ganyan. Kasi tatayu yan, di ba? Yeah, it's very distracting. Very. Kasi if I'm looking at you, you're like, di ba? Gaganon yung kausap nyo. So it seems so small, but that just shows you are upgrading yourself. So with me, I actually have also a little spray net or a little gel just to just tame this area para smooth. Thank you, Mirza, for bringing that out. Hi, OC daw ako. <laughs> yes, yes, I am. I'm a control no. freak too. <laughs> and you know, it might seem like so uh, nitpicky, Trivial. but when people yeah. are bored, they're looking at everyone on the on all the screens, they're and they're bored. like distracted by what's very distracting. Right? Exactly, Mirza. Instead of you listening to what I'm saying, and I'm sure it's important. Because why did I call for this meeting? Why are we meet, why, why are you presenting to me now? Diba? Parang, why am I giving you the plans for, for this quarter? If all you're thinking is, di nakatulog si ma'am. Ay, ganda pala nung, ano, ganda pala nung tumahay ni ma'am. 
'di ba? Yung ganun ba? Yun ang mga iniisip because again, see this is a screen. You are coming across a screen. And how do we usually treat screens? Swipe left, right, right. Off, tune out. Right. You right. that's you now. That's you. So don't you want to again upgrade, make yourself sound and look interesting just so you 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 deserve their attention. Right. Yeah, that, and that, we that, have uh, a question from yes, Owen. Hi. <laughs> mm. She said, "I hope there's also a tip about presentations. Never show hi, a Owen. presentation being set up. My pet peeve. Yeah. Dapat title nakaagad once it's on slide view. That's true. That is so true, Owen. Uh, that's why I keep saying, please sign up for my webinar. These are the <laughs> other extras that I actually talk well, about in the webinar. Now. You can." Sign up when <laughs> I have one this Saturday. I have one this Saturday, two to three thirty p.m. But again, Mirza mentioned it na earlier. When you share screen, make sure your what do you call this? Uh, desktop. Desktop is clean. Yeah, the desktop is clean. Only open what you need. And you're right. When it comes to presentations, I know you're probably editing it. I know you're probably reviewing it. But just know five minutes before you even log in meeting. Before you put in the ID, meeting ID, or whatever, make sure everything is set. So by the time you hit that share screen button and you see that presentation, you are ready. I think, yes, that is the mark of a true professional. You are prepared and everything can be prepared. You know why? Zoom meetings are scheduled. You can't say you didn't know. Diba? Right. Alam mong three o'clock yan. In fact, if you only log in at three, you're late. Log in five minutes before. Right. Log in five minutes before. That's what makes you a pro. Right. <laughs> um, any other uh, tips that uh, we can think for of? More, like, for more I've, tips, sign up. <laughs> yes. Uh, what can they expect from your webinar? Oh, yeah. Uh, definitely more tips on how to deliver better. Of course, uh, I talked volume. Mirza knows my three other letters because it'll help you sound engaging and interesting. And that's from my acting background. Then definitely how to work the camera more, how to be more understood. Because again, what's the point of doing meetings if hindi ka naman naiintindihan, right? So the, why are we communicating? You forget at the most basic, at the most basic. This is all about communications. And if you're talking to a friend, yeah, what? Can't hear you. Yeah, ano yan? That's your friend. What if it's your boss, your employee? It's about respect. It's about making sure the cascade of, of what it's like in your organization or your business is still translated online. And trust me, it's usually lost. With the things I've been watching also, I'm like, ay, ay. Diba? You lose, con not one respect. Pero nakakawala ng konting credibility ba na alam mong boss ka and right. ikaw pa yung magpa-fumble. Right. Diba? Yung mga ganon. So even with employees, you this is a great way now to shine in the eyes of your bosses. Because hey, you're front and center. You are in close up. So kung hindi kayo napapansin ng bosses nyo or executives nyo before dahil dun ka sa cubicle na yon na nakatago somewhere, hindi nyo ka-floor, but you were asked to be joined in this meeting, yes, take they advantage. are seeing you. They are hearing you. So yes, be your best self. Be in your best presentation mode. Sign and I up. think if you're shy, it's probably easier to uh, overcome your shyness when you're talking to a light on your laptop rather than That's facing like a boardroom, right? Yes, then rather than seeing people. Actually, you're right, Mirsa. That's such a good thing, a good realization, a good insight. If you're shy, guess what? You're just talking to a screen. Yeah. In fact, like here, like what I'm doing right now, I'm actually not looking at the Zoom. I can't even see you. And I'm actually covering here. See, I'm covering it. I can put like a piece of paper somewhere here. I don't need to see it. So I'm just really talking to that little circle, yeah. but right. I'm connecting. Cover the, cover the faces of your bosses and just talk <laughs> to the camera. And talk to the camera. Just project yourself. Right? Or you don't That's have to face like a crowd of hundreds to deliver a talk, right? Like yes. That's true also. That's so true. Hey, for introverts then, this is 
this is a good medium for yes. you. Yes. Because <laughs> now you don't have to talk to so many people around you. It's yeah, now like filtered naturally. I'm an introvert, believe it or not. And so this has been the perfect way for me. That's why you're such a thing with your help and mentorship. You're thriving. Mirza, you have two shows. Oh my God. On Facebook and YouTube. And look at the lineup of guests who are who you've who you've already had. And you're in your element, Mirza. Oh I, my I God. I'm telling you, Come I love you. you. <laughs> I would never have thought you're an introvert. Oh, and look at so I've been Galen. faking it this whole time. And I'm so appreciative of your support and your mentorship. And so people, you know. please sign up for her class on Saturday. It will change you. You, so many ways. you love it up, Mirza. Oh, yeah. Thanks to you. And I guess this is no longer the new normal, but the normal. How it long will normal. we go on, right? We need to, like, bone up on these skills. Uh, to everybody watching, we don't see a solution to COVID anytime soon right so do yourself this favor because what i'm again what i'm teaching what what's in my webinars are not just thoughts and ideas i am giving you skills i, I in fact I, i've even been told you know you're not holding anything back huh? <laughs> but i actually handed it to you in a checklist in, in you know in applicable ways that you do it on the spot, you'll already notice. What more if you start doing it over and over and over again until it becomes a habit, that you don't have to think about it anymore. And that's yeah. what I think my dream and goal is. If everybody can be better communicators, it's a win-win situation for all, for all. It's not even about me. Now everybody, hindi na tayo kailangan mag, di ba, mag, ano daw, mis, may misunderstanding, may lost in translation, di ba? This, do this for yourself, please. And I'm really more than happy to share it with all of you. Applicable, practical tips. Definitely. You are so oh, generous. Can I share also what's exciting, uh, what's very, yes. very exciting, and I'm saying it for the first time. I just finished a second module. So this is my, not the one basics, but the intro level, which is upgrading your online presence and delivery. It's all about yourself, right? My second one is for interviews and moderating wow. online. It was asked me, you, you asked me that actually when I, I gave you guys feedback forms. What else would you want me to talk about? A lot of you asked about interviewing, moderating, especially if you're talking to four or five people at the same time, especially here in this online medium. I, I have it already. I'm, I, I, it's loaded. I just need to lock it in. And my friend has to help spruce up the PowerPoint presentation. <laughs> Oh, hi, Philip. He's saying, yes, <laughs> online is really a more demanding and unforgiving medium. Making it look easy, like what Mirza and I hopefully are doing now, what we're doing, it looks easy. But it's because we put in the effort to, to look better and sound better. There's effort. There's definitely, really definitely does, effort. It really does look so easy, but I found out it's so hard. <laughs> but thanks to people like Isa who are so generous in sharing their um, talent and expertise. Thank you so much for sharing everything you know in this mini session for us on yeah. online. I'll impact. see you in August. I'll see you in August. Oh, I'll, yeah. I'll, I'll post the poster for the interviews and moderating. I'll, I'll definitely make sure you're one of the first to hear about Thank it. You. Thank you, Mirza, for this. invite them to your uh, Saturday webinar. Hi, again, to everyone watching here in Mirza's page. Uh, if you would like to upgrade your online presence and delivery, again, this is not just hosting. This is for your everyday communication online because there's no escaping this arena. This is how we communicate nowadays. I have a webinar this Saturday, July 18, and I still have some slots available, 2 to 3.30 p.m. Uh, just send me a message on Instagram or here on Facebook at OneLitCorp or at Isa Leton via Instagram or here in the page. Send me a PM or a DM. It's uh, 2,500 pesos per person. And I'll send you my bank account so we can finalize the transaction. And then I'll send you the Zoom link and whatever materials you might need so that you can actually enjoy, learn, and have fun in my webinar. It's fun. I promise you that. <laughs> Thank you so much, Isa.
Thank you so Mirza. Wow, that was I'll an hour now. <laughs> We're uh, exactly according to schedule because we prepared and we talked about it. And because, of course, you're Issa Litton. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you, Mirza. See you soon. Bye, Bye, everybody. Bye, everyone. Bye, everyone. This has been Ask Miss Mears, and I'll see you soon. It's because you're a direct.